Hello, I'm Kenneth Branagh. Worldwide, film is one of the influential art forms of our time. It inspires our imagination and it teaches us about life and people. And for me, nowhere is this more important or more powerful than in working with young people. Film education is helping people look more closely at film, look at a wider range of film, and then help them, if they want to, to make films for themselves. It's about preparing it, people for the creative economy. I think we all recognise that creative industry is very important, and film education supports that. We don't help children learn to read and write so they can become published writers, although some of them do. We want them to read and write so that they can participate as democratic citizens, and we think that film is just as important as, uh, as, as print literacy in, in that sense. It's about democratic entitlement and civic participation. Film is being used in the classroom and outside schools across the UK, helping children in their learning and development. Film education can encompass both watching films and making films. And the best kind of film education engages young people in active learning. It goes beyond just passively consuming or watching films. Film, we felt, was very enriching for the children because it's a very visual medium. We thought it was something they would immediately feel drawn to. They're very familiar with film, with moving image at home, and if they can understand the role that a director or cameraman or sound person has made when they've made that film, then we help them to make the links with what an author would do in that same situation. And for those children, it's been particularly successful. When making a film, they really have to focus and learn about the very subject that they're proposing to make a film about. It's an amazing tool, animation, because you get so many opportunities to say well done to students, particularly those that are quite disaffected by education. The whole process, they've got to work as a team, and it's just brilliant, um, particularly uh, kids that haven't got high levels of literacy and numeracy. They really do get inspired by making films. The benefits of film education, whether it's young people making animations to help get engaged with poetry, or showing young people archive film to better understand history can be seen in all areas of the curriculum. I think just watching a film just makes it more real, it's more, more exciting, more fun. It's got a greater emotional impact on a, like a personal level. It gives a really authentic view of the student voice. It provides a powerful experience for students that links directly to elements of the curriculum and allows children and young people to engage with and question texts. It also contributes to increased positive social interaction skills and cultural understanding. We have developed their creative practice, their critical appreciation of film, but we've also wanted to, to give them a broader understanding of culture. It makes me uh, more interested in the French language because instead of just imagining the culture, you can actually see the culture. Film has this amazing capacity to be able to bring lots of diverse cultural ideas into play. It's really a powerful medium to get young people sort of back into learning. For today's students, film is being integrated right across the curriculum in teaching languages, history, English, geography, literature, sciences and even mathematics as well as being studied in its own right. There are lots of different places in the curriculum where film can support and kind of express and inspire children to learn better. Absolutely, we want film to be part of the curriculum, for it to be part of the cultural, um, the critical education of all young people. Coming here, I've learnt so much from science, from use of PowerPoints, animations, films. We produced um, a tool for primary school teachers, a CD-ROM resource called Maths and Movies, um, and this helped use concepts of film um, for mathematics in the primary classrooms. It's meant a lot of change for some teachers. It's meant moving away from merely a print-based uh, curriculum to including moving image work. Teachers are often concerned a lot about writing and reading and getting children to link with those skills. Um, and I think the, the link between film and writing is not immediately obvious or clear, but it can be developed really well. For many teachers, they weren't uh, versed in how to read and analyse a film. 
So we have worked um, with the British Film Institute's cultural and technical codes of analysing film. Our resources online and um, that we provide to teachers in the post are designed to be accessible by everybody. Well, I love doing film uh, because it shows a, a creative nature and I think part of school education is obviously getting the grades but is also allowing students to grow as people. There is a noticeable improvement in their attainment in writing and in particular in their vocabulary and their text structure. This improvement in educational achievement includes core skills such as reading and writing. The skills used in reading a film are comparable to the skills used in written literacy and they form an essential part of communication. Students also learn from watching films themselves that their peers have made so they're able to both peer and self-assess their own work. Now we know that young people love films but it also really helps to get them interested and engaged in learning. We surveyed teachers who say that they see the use of film in education as improving the motivation, the concentration and even the behaviour and attendance of students. Because children are more motivated in their learning, they want to come to school. So many schools report to us that they have uh, a better attendance. It does add that extra dimension that um, the normal curriculum doesn't offer. When we use film in different lessons, it makes me just want to come to lessons more. Where schools have worked to integrate film fully into their curriculum, it's helping to achieve their educational objectives and contributing to outstanding Ofsted reports. If one student who does these animations in my class feels like that they've built enough confidence to become a scientist and, and make a big difference to the world, then it's all been worthwhile. Because film communicates in a range of ways, through speech, through the written word and physical activity, it gives teachers the ability to develop the attainment of learners of all abilities. And for those young people who discover a talent or an interest and are committed, um, we need to make sure that there's lots of pathways open to them to take their skills on to the next level. Most of their lives are li lived through film and television, watching it. So understanding how it's constructed, I believe, is essential. Film helps people look more closely at the world, at ourselves, at other people. Um, and I, th I think that's a really important dimension of film that maybe other art forms and other media don't really capture in quite the same way. Critically, culturally and creatively, film is a key literacy skill for young people and every young person should have the opportunity to watch films, to learn from them and to make them. Thank you for watching.